I'm Anand Alagappan, director of this movie Anything For You and I'm a big fan of WHCC. Hey guys, how you doing? This is Ryan Holder with Studio JNS and Liberty Productions. I'm here, we just saw an amazing movie called Anything For You and we're here with the director. I'm gonna let him introduce himself to you. I'm Anand Alagappan, I'm the writer, director, producer of Anything For You. Tell me, what was your inspiration? You were the director. Have you done any other projects in the past? Yeah, I, I did a short film called No Exit. It, it's a comedy about credit card service. You press one, two, three, nine. It's like no exit, like a nightmare. It goes on and on. And then I, uh, this is my first feature film. Uh, the story is about relationships, you know. You know, the relationship between a father and a daughter, between a husband and a wife. And, you know, it, it's, it revolves around relationships. It's a triangle love story. It seems like a great love story. In the beginning, it's almost like she's stalking him, and then there's, like, a past life. So we really don't know what's going on. But at the end, it's a lot. It's a great movie. Yeah. How was it a hard task for you to direct this movie? Is it something that different for you? Or? Yeah, being an independent filmmaker, it was tough, you know. And uh, I shot it on red camera. You know, red is a boon for independent filmmakers. It, it, it breaks the barrier. And then, you know, you get a lot of freedom to give a quality film. You would have seen it, it looks exactly like a 35 mm film. You know, so, you know, th th that was really helpful. And uh, my cast was amazing. I did all the casting and everything. When you get the cast right, 90% of the film is done, successful. You know? It's much easier when you do the casting yeah. right, right? Everything kind of comes to life. Well, that's fantastic. Can you tell the audience what they can do, what you did to kind of get to where you are, and what they can do to kind of be like you? Uh, first thing I would say is patience persistence you know you should love the job what you do and then hard work definitely pays it you know and then you know you, you keep doing keep doing you know hundred percent commitment and then you know you can definitely make it how you doing I'm Aaron Mathias and I played Brian and anything for you what's up it was such a great movie we're here in Jersey City at cinemas 12 now one of the movie, one of the good things about the movie is that it had me going for a long time I didn't know if she was a little <laughs> crazy for a little bit yeah. reading the script what was going through your mind uh, same thing, man. I didn't know where initially it was going because I didn't see actually some of the ending stuff until like right before we shot it. So I didn't even like know. I was like, all right, I'm gonna all of a sudden kiss her. What goes on? Like, what's going on? So it was it was a surprise for me also. I'm sure that made for a very interesting process. Yeah. <laughs> now tell us a little bit about your background, how you became into acting in this film, and a little bit about what you're from. Where you're from? Okay, uh, originally I'm from Michigan, a small town called Harris. Doesn't really exist. <laughs> um, it's so small. Uh, I came to New York when I was like 18 years old. Um, I went to the neighborhood playoff school theater, and then I've been pretty much acting ever since. I just actually did a sci-fi series that's out right now on, um, you know, Sony Sony has a, a channel called Crackle, and the series is playing on there, it's called Trenches. Well, keep the projects coming. So where can we find you? Facebook, MySpace, what do you, yeah, what do you got? On Facebook, uh, I'm on MySpace, just under my name, Aaron Mathias. Sounds Become a fan. <laughs> Why not? We are all fans here. Don't stalk me, okay? Don't stalk me. No stalking, right? <laughs> just like the movie, no stalking, please. Hi, I'm Sharon Reed Johnson, and I played Aunt Betty. Hi. <laughs> now, the character that you played in this movie, had the daughter was one of the main characters, and she had a very, very different personality. Now, was that hard playing for you, or what was going through your mind when you first read through the script? Actually, when I auditioned, Anon asked me if I had any difficult children in my life, and I have a difficult niece, so I knew exactly what it was like. So it was kind of just natural. Oh, okay. Well, I'm. Well, we thank that niece. That's pretty difficult because I'm yeah. sure she helped you. You pull from that. That's fantastic. Yeah. Now, what about your background? Have you done a lot of training? I'm sure you have to play such a role. What, what have you done in the past? Well, actually, I was an accountant for 20 years, and four years ago, I decided to be an actress. Follow my heart and. Um, um, and I've been studying at the Atlantic Theater Acting School. So, and I've been doing, you know, this was my first independent film, and I really appreciate being part of it. Yeah, it was fantastic. I would never have thought that it was your first film. Fantastic job. No, I'm really privileged to have you here. How is it working with, um, with Sam and with such a decent cast like that? Everyone was really working hard, and everyone really came across well on the film. Yeah, everybody did really work hard. It's just so funny to see Sam be serious, because he was such a cut up, you know, on the set and you know he was just always making us laugh and always having a good time and it was just amazing to see him be serious and intense. So Did the movie come across for you like the way you thought it would come across in the script? Um, yeah it did especially the ending because it seems like a fable to me yeah and it was just lovely I love the ending you know I just love the whole the how it unfolded. 
I do too. Definitely come check it out. We're here at Cinema 12 with anything for you. Thank you so much for coming out, my dear. I'm with the parents of Sam Ghost right now. I, how excited are you? How unbelievable yeah, I'm is this really event? Really excited, you know. Since last night, I couldn't sleep because I was thinking, oh my God, this is his debut feature film. I don't know how the movie will be, how he's going to be. But I'm really proud tonight to say that yes, he did a good job, and movie was very, very good. You know, very, very impressed. Hey guys, Ryan Holder here with some of the fans of the movie, or we should say some fans of Sam's. How'd you guys enjoy the movie? We, yeah, we. All I have to say is that Sam Ghosh is a handsome, handsome man. Oh, and a very look at good that! Actor indeed. Yes. And have you guys seen Sam's work in the past? We have. Yes. I have worked with Sam before on stage, and this is one of the first times I've seen him on screen, actually. Yeah. And it's. Pretty good. I'm proud. I'm so proud. He did, of him. He did us proud. He <laughs> yeah. Us proud. And, and how do you know Sam? Um, he's a friend of mine too. We're sort of in the same <laughs> Feel, artistic. Yeah. Field. And you say that he did everything. He did you guys justice. You were proud of him today. Yeah, totally. They were sure. Very yeah. nice. Anything you want to say to Sam? If you could watch this video, what would you say to him? <laughs> we're gonna be like, <laughs> um, Sam, we love you. Love you, Sam. <laughs> no, we really do. We're we so. Do. We're super proud of you, dude. Good job. <laughs> there you go, Sam, right from you, directly from your fans. Thank you so much. Yes, I, we supported all along, but I had a doubt in my mind, you know, uh, because there is not income is in, involved. Uh, I know that thing beginning nobody earns, but question thing, he gave up that his four years career. He is an engineer. Uh, I don't have back of my mind any doubt that he'll be successful, but how long it is going to take? Hey guys, how you doing? This is Ryan Holder with Studio JNS and Liberty Productions. I'm with the man of the evening, Sam Ghosh, the head actor, the main actor of the entire movie. How was it? Did it come across the way you wanted it to? Tell us what you thought of the movie. Um, you know, film's a really funny, it's a funny medium. Um, you do uh, a lot of work, you put in your heart and soul. Um, uh, in a lead role, you, you, you you do your best to carry the film, you do your best to justify the character, and then with editing and music, it just um, it gets only better from there, and it gets elevated to a completely different level. I'm awestruck, I'm, um, uh, it's, it's, it's crazy that so many people I love and care about are here. It's, um, like, it's like a whirlwind right now, right? It's like a whirlwind. I think all, all day I was sick to my stomach, I wanted to vomit, I, I, I went to the bathroom like like three, three four, five times like uh, in every hour. Um, uh, uh, it's, 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 it's so overwhelming, but people um, people have been so supportive um, through the whole process. And a night like this, just in terms of the people who are, who are coming and just in terms of the people who are here, it makes like all the struggles, it makes everything feel super worthwhile, you know? And and, and yeah, yeah, I'm just I'm super thankful. And, and honestly, I, I came and I, I hadn't seen the movie before today. Um, and it still, like, on top of my nerves and everything, it was more, I, I wanted to be a good show for everybody that, that comes. Um, and I hope it is, and I hope people have a good time, and, and that's all you can ask for as an actor. Well, we definitely enjoyed it, I can tell you that for sure. We had a fantastic time. How does it feel knowing that everybody's here to see your show and your film? Um, I, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm humbled. I'm, I'm, um, I don't even, uh, I, I think it'll hit me tonight. I think I think I'll be lying in my bed and be like, "Wow, people I haven't seen in years came out to support." Um, uh, yeah, it's it's really beautiful. Well, who Sam Ghosh is? A little bit about your past and how you got here today. Um, wow. Um, uh, uh, watching a lot of Indian movies um, is is uh, I've I've seen just I I grew up uh, in a in a, a Hindi movie store. Um, uh, kind of, and my parents uh, have a home video business, and um, there are just, uh, and I'm an only child, so I didn't really have, didn't really have, uh, you know, obviously didn't have siblings, didn't have friends, didn't have, I was just growing up with movies, and um, what it gave me, now I, I feel like I want to be giving to someone else in that same way, um, uh, and You're then paying it forward, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sam Ghosh, and I'm a fan of World Heritage Cultural Center.